Now you will see 5 electrical hacks that will help you in extreme conditions. Let us get started. Number 5. 220 volt electrical network welding. If you need to weld something urgently and you don't have a welding machine within easy reach, you can weld something applying 220 volt electrical network voltage directly to a welding electrode. Cool! You may be surprised, but it really works. As you can see, the code is plugged directly into the outlet. It is neatly fixed here in order to prevent electrical shock. It is grounded and the phases are connected here. It is connected with the electrode. Look at the entire net. In order to get the needed electrical current for welding, you can connect a thick steel wire or a job brine parallel to the electrode. By varying the length of the wire or the electrode in the jar, we can regulate a wide range of the current flow. When I applied the voltage of the electrical network directly, the welding current was within the limits of 200 amperes. The arc would spark easily, the electrodes would burn out like a match. Along with that, it would be easy to cut through any metal. On the other hand, in order to weld a steel item, I confided the current flow to the 100 amperes with the help of some brine. If your wiring is not designed to carry high voltage, you need to plug it directly into the plug. What is it? Don't forget about safety. Use gloves and gum boots. Number 4. A lamp made from a pencil. If you take the lid out of your pencil and connect wires to it, you will get a lamp. Despite the fact that the scheme is pretty easy, it shines brightly. Optimal voltage is 12 volts. I apply voltage of an old laptop's battery. You can also use such a lamp with the lighter. These are not all possible uses of the pencil. Watch what's coming up. Number 3. Electrical engraving. Do you want to engrave an inscription on a knife or a donia cultury? Now you will see how to do it just with a pencil. We will need two cords, a pencil, some device that consumes electrical power. Let us take a pencil and strip it on two sides. Wrap a wire around it and insulate it. Let us connect the other wire to the consumer of electrical power in series. Let us draw the pattern with the pencil without the voltage applied to it in order not to spoil the engraving. Then let us connect the pencil to the power supply system and stipple the pattern. Now let us rub off the pencil drawing. We've got an engraving with burnt embossed surface you can remove only if you remove a thick layer of steel. Number 2. How to get rid of mice in 5 minutes? You need to find a mouse call and put an electrolytic capacitor into it. Seal the capacitor tightly with an injure slipper and plug in the capacitor. Thick steam of smoke will force the mice out of the holes. They won't get back soon. Mice and rats have a panic-driven and unexplained fear of capacitor smoke. Number 1. An ultra-fast reheating of food. If you stick forks into your food and apply socket voltage to it, your food will heat very fast. You don't need any heating element because the food itself is electrically resistant and gets heated evenly both inside and outside. Just in one minute both solid and liquid food gets heated. Almost no electrolysis and oxidation take place under the influence of 220 volt voltage, that is why the reheated food does not lose its taste and is not dangerous. By the way, some electric kettles work on the same principle. There were two electrodes inside them and no hidden element. In our next video, you will see interesting and by no means less useful life hacks with Wi-Fi. Subscribe to the channel in order not to miss it. If you like the video, share it with your friends. There is a button below the video to share the video.